Good afternoon, Penn Staters. Hello, Penn State New Boys. I'm very proud to be a part of and help with a, a, a program at a great university that where we really are one team. And what I like to say is that we're one team at Penn State where ICA, Intercollegiate Athletics, equals IAC. Integrity, Academics, and Championships. Bill, Guy, they're the type of people that, when we're growing up, you know, go over to our buddy's house, and pick up football game, pick up basketball game, baseball game, whatever. You know, you go out, you don't get back until your mom calls you for lunch or for dinner. These guys would fit in real, really well with our group. But they're the guys that you didn't want to play without. And as, as part of the coaching staff of this great athletic department, these are the guys that I don't want to be without. And one of the things I want to bring up is, is what you see when you watch a football program and you saw those guys uh, on the field giving everything but having a blast. Like just, it's just so apparent how much they had so much fun. Along with Dr. Joyner, uh, Coach O'Brien deserves so much credit for bringing that, really, that, that same attitude is, is in our coaches' meetings, it's perforated to our athletic department, and you become part of something much, much, much bigger and, and special. And when I say special, I know people, just like you, can tell you the reason, the whole reason that happened is because everywhere we've gone, in Pennsylvania, and we've been to Hershey, and we've been to uh, Wilkesbury, we've been to Philadelphia, we've been to Pittsburgh, at Consul Arena, and we'll be there again, by the way. But everywhere we go, the support that we've got has been absolutely phenomenal. Not just in numbers, but in how Penn Stayers support their university, their athletic department, their individual teams is phenomenal. And I'm telling you right now, that's the reason why we were able to have success that I don't think anybody thought we could. It's what makes us great. So I want to thank you for all that you do that makes us great. So good evening, Penn Staters. Are you out there? It's always great to be back in the Berg. We have to remember that the success of our students now and years from now is why we are here. That's why we're here. You know, we talk about, Dave and I, along with the other coaches, we talk about one team because we believe it. Up in athletics, they're, they're people that are ordinary people who do extraordinary things with their teams. And uh, it, it, I'm very proud to be associated with these guys. Being on the caravan is motivating for, for two reasons. And, and one, you get to be a part of this crew. You get to, you talk about what you, what you shoot for. How about 15 Final Fours in a row for Coach Powell? How about, think about that, 15 in a row. <laughs> we, we know what Coach O'Brien achieved on the field. Absolutely remarkable. What, what I find most spectacular of all of it. If you can imagine the circumstances that that, that team was under, um, how to maintain an attitude and, and lead and leadership in, in a very positive way. It, not only the team, the, the, entol, the whole program, y your, your staff, the community, everybody, is uh, the, the work ethic that it takes to do that. Uh, it takes a lot of intelligence and it takes greater, great leadership. But I tell you, the work ethic that it takes to do that is phenomenal. All my expectations about how great the university is and how great the feeling is, that special feeling, it's all surpassed. Somebody told me when the sanctions came out, Penn State football is going to be irrelevant. I say that's a bunch of malarkey. <laughs> Something else I want to tell you that I think is the truth, because I really do, I get tired of hearing otherwise. You know, our coaches, uh, Dave Joyner, our athletic department staff, our academic support staff, and certainly our student athletes, we have a culture of integrity. And that's not something new to Penn State. That's, I've, that's been here long before I got here. And as a football team, we're going to do our part. We're going to be prepared. We're going to play hard. It's not going to be easy. But we're going to show up, and we're going to play hard, and we're going to be competitive. 
And when we keep it level for a few years here, so that when the sanctions are over, we can take off running, we're going to take off running.